Hello again, this is Hiro Uzuki with part 15 of the Fallout 4 Let's Play, the game in which my aggressive friend-making last time got me three aggressive friends. Or at least McCready and Kate are aggressive. I suppose Piper is aggressive herself, in that she is always aggressively looking for her next story. We'll find something for her to do, probably. In the meantime, if you happen to agree that aggressive friend-making is the way to go in the wasteland, then please hit that like and subscribe button, and know that, should you do so, you will have aggressively made a friend in me. You're making that look easy. Okay, real quick while we're here, let's, uh, see about modding some weaponry. One more. One more rank and gun nut, and I can start playing with the fun stuff. I also need the science perk. I also need a million dollars, but I'm not getting that anytime soon. One more rank, at least. I should probably go ahead and put the uh, heavy incinerator away for a while. Give it a break. As I mentioned before, it's going to become a crutch if I use it all the time. And okay, so I turn that off. When pigs fly, that sounds fun. Let's do that. And real quick, let's go ahead and uh, put that perk point to intelligence. And the next one, too. Let's max out that intelligence stat. Righteous authority goes there, and there we go. And we'll stick with the shotgun for now. It's got plenty of batteries, we can make it work. That Brahmin is always there, no matter how many times I play through this game. Maybe want to do something about this. We don't want that poor Brahmin blowing itself up. Hello, good sir. Excuse me. Best scrap in the Commonwealth. Right here. Scrap, you say? I'll take a look, sure. Okay, so he's a weapons vendor. A nail gun. Interesting. Okay, I'll, I'll go ahead and take that. What else do you have? Saw blade launcher? Oh, this seems like it could be a fun time indeed. Let's take it. I've got the money for it. Uh, you do have ammo for this stuff, right? You don't sell a toy and not sell batteries for it. 40 millimeter frag grenades. Keep talking, I'm liking where this is going. Yes. Now he's got fusion cores, but I can't get all of them. Ugh. No, this is more of his inventory. A shame. Oh, well. Alright, so what do we got here? Wait, isn't this near the Cambridge Crater? You picked a very dangerous place to set up shop, dude. 
Chinese grenade launcher. Keep talking. Keep talking. I'm liking what I'm hearing. Oh, well, that's a shame. It's a shame I won't be getting my grenade launcher, apparently. Monsignor Plaza. I, I'm pretty sure I'm pronouncing that wrong. But isn't that raider territory? Yeah, I'm pretty sure this Marvin guy is dead. Sorry, my condolences. Customer orders. Chinese grenade launcher. Frag gun that can punch through power armor. I'll believe that when I see it. And if I see it, I shall buy it. Baseball launcher. <laughs> Interesting. Does it take baseball grenades as munitions? I'm asking for a friend. Pipe grenade launcher. You're selling them to raiders. They're gonna ask for more than just the launchers, dude. Nail gun, just got it. No, oh, no. For all we know, there might be one or two raiders who might have an interest in carpentry. You never know. Saw blade launcher. Well, what do you expect? Raiders aren't exactly the sharpest tool in the shed, the brightest bulb in the box. Pillow launcher. Well, I'm... Th that kind of weapon technically does exist. It's called the Junk Jet. It's all fun and games until someone gets decapitated by a teddy bear. At which point, it becomes hilarious. Hmm. Now I want to find a teddy bear and load it into the Junk Jet. Anyway. Got some new hardware to try out. Yep. Yep, this is... Shit, right next to the, uh, Cambridge Crater. But anyway, let us test out the new hardware. Okay, so it fired the first. All right, interesting. I uh, I could probably get some use out of this. Exactly a proper test for the weapon now, was it? Thank you. Isn't it though? Sorry, I I just need a proper test of the new weapon. You must understand, I have new hardware. I can't not use it. Oh, 
Okay, it's not much, but it's got some uh, damage over time. That's neat. Here you go, have another grenade. Enjoy that, that's for you. Did any of those even hit? Jesus Christ, how would you miss all those? Nathan, buddy, you're sucking. You suck. Why do you suck so much? Tell with them, might as well go ahead and claim the box. Mine! Oh, Finders keepers! Oh, rounds. Nice. Yes, Alright. You don't need these. You're risking your life for a pipe weapon. You are desperate, aren't you? Desperation, thy name is the Gunners. get mixed up in that McCready? It's Super Mutants versus Raiders. Let's see how this plays out. Disappearing? Are you serious? What are you so pissed off for? I told you this guy was aggressive. Get away from this spot. Safety off. I think we 
have company. Don't mind if I do. Magic science juice. Plasma cartridges. I need to buy some more of those. Now I brought the 44 along, I should really use it. Shush, you heard nothing. Hold still. Hold still. Thank you. What? Oh, man, please don't. You guys are just stirred up with hell. I found him! Okay, that looked like it hurt. Hi, how's it going? I feel like I got gypped. Robot, time to come to life. Yes. First try. And for personality, this subway steward. I know it's a police protectron, but a change in career never hurt anyone. Much, I think. here. Uh, nothing. <laughs> Ow. Every second you hide, I just get madder. Is that right? Well, here I am. Okay, bye. Thanks for playing. The game is trying to tell me something. 
It's telling me to get that gun nut rank three and get my 50 caliber rifle. Griswold. Isn't that that raider who fashions himself a poet? And is like super egotistical or narcissistic at the very least? And who apparently has a hard on for this Sue character. Oh, yeah, he's a narcissist. And yep, he shot her dead. I shall take his hollow tape just because. Just be a dick to him. Hello. Excellent. Yes. Yes, we can has. We can has nice things. Put that there. And batteries for the weapon. I hate Sug. Despise him. He mocks my ideas. Tell me they're impractical and a symptom of an underlying mental issue. I don't know. Come the apocalypse. The people who have impractical ideas, are they really being impractical or are they fucking geniuses? The choice is yours. Three years I gave my sweat and tears and brain cells to that grateful son of a bitch, helping turn his boring ideas into a reality. Uh, one day I asked him when he'd make me a full-time partner and he said when pigs fly. Oh, please do not tell the impractical guy to make pigs fly. He will do it somehow. I made pigs fly, in fact, me and my new friends see him next, these little piggies are going to fly right into his stupid face. I am both terrified and intrigued. Go on. Sir, to die will be my pigs that kill him. I know just where to wait for him to... Okay, so Marvin is very much alive and he is looking to kill Suggs. I've been proven wrong. He is not dead. Pork from above. Broken glass cuts the skin, and the cut becomes infected, and then he dies weeks later due to a lack of available medical supplies and poor health infrastructure. Everything he owns will be mine. Well, if you kill a person in the wasteland, what there what was once theirs is now legally yours. Seems legit. Piggy bank mine. Interesting. Okay, well, I've got to take the teddy bear. After all, all that talk of, uh... Of, uh, decapitating someone with a uh, teddy bear using the junk jet kind of got me thinking. There should still be a raider around here. I need to test this thing. <laughs> Works well enough for me. All right, we got everything of value here. At least I think we did. So, uh, yeah. Let's make like a banana and split. Jesus, how long was I in there? It's already light out. I must have a concussion. I don't fucking see him. That's right. You have a concussion. That was a raider. I think. Oh, hey. New source of ferals. Just that or an escaped uh, convict. 
Or an escaped mental home patient. You never know. Can't see anything from here. What? Let's do this. The hell? What was that? Like someone who wants to do some trading. Let's trade. Smiling Larry has what you need, guaranteed. Do you? Do you really? No, you don't. I was hoping for some more 40 millimeter grenades. What, you clowns afraid of your own shadows now? Get back to work. Hmm. Oh, Jesus Christ, he's got a fat man launcher. Piggy Bank Launcher Bomb. Interesting. Just had to play hero, huh? Play hero, buddy. I am hero. Thanks for playing, dude. Nothing. Piggy Bank Fat Man. Okay. You have my attention. Oh, Jeebus, this has got a lot of damage to it. Baseball grenade. Awesome. Okay, well, I've got this thing. I've got to try it out. The question is, who and what am I trying this out on? Potential victim, I mean, uh, practice time. 
Amazing. And what's that you got down there? Whatever it is, it's mine. Modified baseball, baseball grenades, baseball launcher, and baseballs. Thank you very much. Apparently, when pigs fly, people die. And the world might as well burn. Maybe. Hi. Hi. Hey. Thanks for your help. Yes. Even better. I'm liking where this is going. I'm liking this a lot. I picked up a bunch of new hardware, and now I am overweight. Jesus fucking Christ. Uh, you got a workbench around here I can borrow, dude? I, uh, I'm a bit over encumbered. Oh, right here. I've never been the hammer and nails sort of guy. You should try it sometime. Pull that muzzle brake off. Scrap it. I'll look over the mods later. No, no, we keep the piggy bank mod. Cause this seems like it could be a fun time. Anyway. Uh, da, 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 da. I gotta try this too before we stop. Yum. Taste that radiation. Can you taste it? Can you taste it? I am not dropping the teddy bear. There we go. Real quick, could someone help me test this weapon out? Hey there, buddy. Accurate, but hey, it works. Fun times with weapons, that is what we are having right now. Fun times with weapons, indeed. Damn, the blast area on this thing. Oh yeah, this this is gonna be a fun time indeed. Anyway, uh, having tested out our new toys, why don't we go ahead and stop here while the stopping's good, uh, drop some stuff off, so that way when we, uh, next start up, we'll be good to go. Sort of. Anyway. Thank you for watching the video. If you enjoyed it and the fun times with weapons that we had, then please hit that like and subscribe button, maybe leave a comment, and consider hitting that bell to stay updated with more videos from me. With that, this is Hiro Uzuki signing off. I foresee a great many fun times with weapons.
Very many indeed.